What's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. I got this d this dual temp unit by Southern Case Arts that has two sets of condensers, two circuits, and one of the circuits had a tripped breaker, the circuit for the right skid right there. So the first thing you always want to check, of course, is compressor when you have a tripped breaker. In this case, the first thing I noticed was we had a blown start capacitor. That's never a good sign. So you start by checking compressor resistance across the windings so in this case it was hard to get down in there and reach but I was able to get it on camera and that right there I slipped off but I get it again here and I get a dead short between common and start common and start dead short and then across my other terminals, I get 3.11 k-ohms between both sets of other terminals, between start and run and run and common. 3.1 k-ohms. You want to always make sure that your wires are off of at least one of the circuits or one of the terminals that you're testing. That way you don't get any backfeeding resistance. And that's how you diagnose a compressor. And then this little compressor had dirty condenser coils. I believe that helped kill it. And you always want to have something to reference what your resistance is supposed to be on the compressor. If you pull up a great Copeland app and type in your numbers and you get it right here. And that's it for this short video. Thanks for watching. See y'all later.